Hey gypsies, happy 4th of July. Happy Independence Day. I hope everybody's having a great day. Um, we are, I don't know what we're doing, but I'm sure we're having a great day. So um, I'm recording this actually on Friday, which is July the 3rd. I am at work. Most people got the day off. Hey, I can't complain because I did take the day off yesterday and got caught if you remember seeing me. But anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead. I have a Dollar Tree haul, maybe two. I don't know if I'm going to do both of them right now. I might just go ahead and do them both. Um, but first of all, let, let me just start out with this big bag, see what we got. See what we got. I actually planned on bringing my um, 4th of July hat that I'm going to be using and my, well, I couldn't really wear my 4th of July shirt, but I am wearing my blue today anyway, um, but it is, you know, like I said, it's not 4th of July yet, but I couldn't really bring, bring my hat anyway because that would totally mess up my mop, to tell you the truth. So, um, let me put my phone on charge really quick. I like to try to keep it on charge when I'm in the car because you never know. Okay. Okay, hopefully that didn't mess anything up. All right, let's get started, guys. Um, I used my last one of these the other day. I think it was day before yesterday. I love these. I absolutely love these. You get 30 sheets. It's the aluminum It's the aluminum foil sheets, and I actually had the Reynolds Wrap ones, and I think with theirs you get 20 or 25, one of the two, but they're shorter and... I'm just like, these right here work fine for me. You just got to be careful when you pull them out because they can rip easy if you don't pull them out correctly. But if you pull them out correctly, these things are the bomb. I love them. I use them. So I always try to keep stocked up on them. And then the other day, I bought some Glad gallon size bags and I said I had some more at home of this, the regular kind. Um, but I I didn't so I went and looked and I didn't so I'm like well I need to get some um, so I just grabbed these you get 10 in here it's the sure fresh um, grand format it says Ooh, heavy duty double seal they work just fine guys they really do I found one reusable bag and I just thought it was really cool it's like comic book related sort of um yeah so there it is you got dr strange marvel fanfare iron man thor um i see the incredible hulk i see the black panther i see captain america spider-man it kind of has all things so i thought it was cool that'd be a good for one of the boys, you know, maybe I'll keep all of the cars in here, the Hot Wheels or something like that. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Let's see, I need to t totally unload my car and start all over fresh. Okay, so I got some bins, but I got to show you what is in the bins first. Um, you know me, I'm constantly, constantly buying Bic lighters. I don't know. Do I have a lighter problem? I don't even know. Check them out. Green and orange. So I got those for my husband, of course. Because he said, anytime you see them, get them for me. Okay. And then I still am finding the triple or the uh, energizers, guys. I cannot pass these up. I mean, really. Because with the other ones, I seem like I'm buying batteries all the time. They go dead so fast. And I'm hoping that these energizers will stay good at least twice as long so grab those and I said I was gonna grab one more of these pouches I have been looking for those daggone fluorescent ones um, I've never seen them still um, and I really don't even know what to look, look what I'm looking for all I know is all I find is red and black so that's yeah so I went ahead and grabbed one more of those and then I found some pins, guys, some more novelty pins. Now, you know I've been talking about doing a novelty pin giveaway. <sighs> These are cool. So I got two of each. Look at that. Look at the pearl. It has huge pearls. They have gold and silver. So, yes, please, give me those novelty pins. They look like a staff of some sort, like, you know, like magical staff or something but 
gold and silver, silver and gold. I love that song off of Rudolph. Is it Rudolph? Yeah. Anyway, I got me some of these bins, guys. I love these bins. I have several in my bedroom that I use for different things. I got two gray ones and I got two clear ones. And I love that the way they seal like that. Um, at Walmart, they have huge bins just like this and they have like a teal colored lid that's the only color I've ever seen at Walmart but I have I think four of those at my house and that is the thing that is the things that I'm using to keep my stuff organized that I get from the Dollar Tree so I have several four I think that I've been using so I love these in my bedroom I have one filled with bracelets I have one with scarves that I used to wear which I, I don't know why I haven't been wearing scarves anymore around my wrist I don't know I need to and I'm gonna start doing it again too because I like that look I don't know it's a gypsy-ish, right? The scarf around the wrist deal. Anyway, I'm gonna start doing that again because I do have a lot of scarfs in one of these. And then um, I wanted, I, I got another one because the one I have right now for my bracelets is like, I need another one because I'm crazy about bracelets. You know that, you just know that about me. And then also I'm thinking about starting to um, organize my makeup because right now I have one of those reusable bags, like the really crinkly loud ones, the huge ones, and it weighs probably 20 pounds. And like all of my stuff is up in there. And I'm like, I could organize like, um, like all of the eyebrow and eyeliner and you know stuff like that and all of the highlighters and blushes and stuff in one and just have it more organized because I've got to start organizing things better and then I'll, um, I'm thinking about maybe you know just all of the little things that I'm keep that that people send me the little tiny things that I love that you know I don't, you know, I want to know where they're at. I want to keep them all together and know where they're at. So, you know, just something like this. So anyway, I got three or two clear and two um, gray lids. So grab those. Okay. Now let me open that back up and put my pins back in there. Although I should probably wait till after the thumbnail. I don't know why I don't do the thumbnail first. Well, because I got to... I gotta do the haul and decide what I want to use, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, I, I just also want to say before I continue that I have, this is day four of my one meal a day, um, basically 23 hour fasting, one hour of eating, and this is my fourth day. I'm having wonderful results so far. I mean, you know how it is when you first start a diet but I'm having great results. So when it's been a week, which is Tuesday, I'm gonna do a video devoted to just that subject and how my week went, what, how much I lost, and you know, the, the pros and the cons and stuff like that. I'm definitely gonna do a video on that Tuesday. So I still am currently working on my morning coffee. I have about a drink left maybe. done okay it's 12 52 i started drinking this about eight o'clock i'm gonna say so i've been sipping on this all morning when i go back in um i'm gonna get a um what is it oh my no no not now i can't ginseng and the the omg hold on the tea what is the stuff that's good for your joints? The yellow stuff that they add to, to it's a spice. It's made by Organic India. They sell it on Amazon. My boss likes it and he keeps st stocked up on it in there and I'm gonna order me some to have for home. Um, why do I keep thinking Coumadin? I have no idea, it's not Coumadin. I don't know. I have no clue. If I think of it, maybe I'll put put it up in this area here or something like that. 
I don't know. But anyway, they sell it on Amazon. It's six something a box. I'm not sure. I think you get 20 per box, 20 packets per box. But anyway, I'm going to make me a cup. I'll probably put half hot water and let it steep for about 10 minutes and then fill this up with cold water so I could actually drink it. Um, but I absolutely love it. So anyway, I need help. You'd think this would be helping my brain out some. Anyway, I do have these right here. I went ahead and got me some green tea tea bags because these are really good to help, you know, fuel and brain power and burning calories and high energy. And so I haven't tried the ones at the Dollar Tree, but you get, how many's in here? A hundred tea bags in here. It says with tag and string, thank goodness. I like those. I don't like the ones that don't have the tag in the string. I don't know. I don't, I just don't. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, I just grab those and then I was, this is, here's a wish list item. Okay. They have three different ones. I got two of them. It's the pink Himalayan salt. Now they did have the kind in the little pink bag. I can't remember the name of it. I'm not even going to try. Lord, no, I'm not trying. But pink Himalayan salt. I got the fine one. And these are big bags. This is from Himalayan's Finest Private Reserve. Look at that. On the back it says, Himalayan, Himalayan's Finest delivers you the purest and clearest salt, or cleanest salt in the world. Through a rigorous process, our salt is washed and removes all impurities to ensure that only the finest salt reaches your table. Our salt is 100% natural with no preservatives, chemicals, or dyes. At Himalayan's finest, we strive to bring you 100% pure, hand-minded, hand-minded salt that is found deep within the Himalayan mountains. Himalayan's finest prides itself on the consistency of the product what you buy today will be the same each time you buy it so it says pink himalayan salt helps reduce your blood pressure you know i did not know that that's interesting contains trace minerals that allow for better absorption of salt and helps balance your ph levels so I usually, um, I use pink Himalayan salt on whatever I have for my dinner at nighttime. So I probably should drink, you know, should make a mixture or add a pinch of this in my water of the evening. I don't know. This is just really good for you. So I got that one and then I got this one here. This is the pink Himalayan coarse salt. So got that one there. And if you can see... Yeah, you can see in there how coarse. And what I did, I got one of these. This is the sea salt. Okay, a grinder, the sea salt grinder. Where's, is that the front? Yeah, so I don't know if these are refillable or not. Let me know if you, if you guys know. Because if they're refillable, I'm just going to keep adding the pink Himalayan salt in there. And just keep this, you know, with my pepper like this. So, yeah, I just got that just in case they're refillable. If they're not, no big deal. <coughs> okay. See what else we got here. Um, let me do this bag. Let me do this bag and this right here. And then the rest I'll save for the other haul. First of all, I just grabbed this. I, I haven't bought like anything like this in a while but now that my son and granddaughter live with us um i got one of those the big things from uh, hawaiian punch it was blue i got it at Kroger or at walmart when i did my pickup the other day that thing was gone in one day and it's like i think it's a gallon so i went ahead and picked this up i know this is not healthy or whatever guys but my son i don't even know orange stars and stripes this is a three liter bottle so this will keep him busy for an hour <laughs> maybe but anyway yeah i thought i'd, I'd describe that because he likes some soda pop soda pop 
Okay, and in this bag, I found a couple of Bolero products, which I was excited about. And yes, I did open them just to make sure that nobody else did. So, yeah. So, they had the Just Peachy, and these are Gentle Body Wash, it says. So, Just Peachy and Citrus, Citrus Glow. And the, it says Concentrated Two Times. So, twice the power, I guess. But I'm going to smell them right here right now. It says, provides a radiant glow to your skin with rejuvenating citrus ingredients. And this one says, helps boost skin's radiance for a refreshed, clean feel. So, yay, I was glad to find those. Let's see what they smell like, though. Like, I, when I was picking them up to check them out, people had poked holes in them. So, I'm like, I put, put them back. I'm like, no, I'm not doing it. I'm not getting duped again. Ooh, that smells really good. I love citrus. Let's see what color this comes out as, just out of curiosity. Yeah, it has a sort of little orangey hue, hue to it. It smells like orange. I smell orange and lemon, lime, grapefruit. I smell citrus, so that's good. I'll try that out with my little body poof. My poofy thing, my spongy. And I wanna smell this peach. I gotta see if this smells like anything good. Peaches, fresh peaches. I have to say, right now, I'm very hungry, so, like, I really need to down, like, a bunch of water just to kind of fill, my, fill up my stomach, so, different times, you know, sometimes are harder than others, for sure, oh, yes, let's see the color, I don't, I don't know why I want to see the, it looks like about the same color as the other one, it smells really good, it smells peachy. Peach has never been like one of my favorite scents or flavors, but it does smell good. I like it. It reminds me of those peach rings, those um, gummy peach rings that you can buy. It smells like that. So, and those smell good. So that's cool. That's cool. Grab these for my son. Um, while I was out, my husband sent me a text and said, get Jeremy some um, ankle socks, black, um, he wanted me to get, get him a pack, and I'm like, okay, but I wasn't going to Walmart or anything, so I just grabbed these just to tide him over. My husband informed me, um, I don't know if I've told you guys this, but he's, he informed me that he does not, not like Dollar Tree socks. After all the Dollar Tree socks that I've bought, he informed me that he doesn't like Dollar Tree socks. He said, because you can see through them, so... I was like, okay, so I had to buy him some regular socks. I feel like I have told you guys that. But anyway, these are the, you get three pa pair in here, which is good. Athletic low-cut socks for men. So I'll take them in to Jeremy today when I go. And I could use a nap right now. I found two, okay, I, I, hold on. <laughs> I could use a nap right now, guys, okay? Now, let me start the next sentence. I found two nail polishes, and this reminds me, because I've been looking for that color um, that Anna from Only In My Dreams, she was wearing one day. I don't know if this is it, but it sure does look a lot like it, so I thought I'd grab it, and then I think I just got two. Let me make sure. These are both gorgeous colors. Yeah, I think that's all I got. So, I got this one here, and they are very sparkly and pretty. And this is called Treasure Island. What a cute name. They're LA Colors, Color Craze, High Impact Nail Color. So whenever I decide not to wear fake nails and actually paint my nails, I will totally try these out and see how they are. And I've got nail, you know, the little stickers, nail art things that I can use with them and absolutely love that one and this one too this one's gorgeous too it is called you know i gotta pull them out at least once guys whoa 
It's called Glistening Purple. And there's that color. Can you see that? Can you see? Oh my goodness, they're gorgeous. So yeah, I don't know if it's a new line. It says the brush, it says uh, high quality flat brush. So that's cool. But yeah, I'm like, I will take both of those. And they had another one or a couple more actually. They didn't have a ton of these though. So I loved them. Okay, I grabbed this for Jack. She asked me to get her some mouthwash. They had the pink kind that they always had, but I just, I, that blue is just so pretty, isn't it? It matches my scrubs today. Um, Firefly. I have no idea what Firefly is, if it's a movie or something. It's in bubble. Well, it says the lot from the Lion King. It says the Lion King. I don't know, maybe Firefly was on the Lion King, like the, the new one, I don't know. If you know guys, let me know, because I'm curious. Um, it says the flavor is bubble gum, so she'll like that. She will like that. I had to get me a new bathroom mirror, so I got this color here, and yeah. Never look at yourself in the mirror when you're out in the actual daylight, because you'll see wrinkles that you never knew you had. It's true. So, yeah, look at those wrinkles. Oh my gosh. Anyway, I come to think, of, I was going to tell you guys, I found in my humongous bottomless makeup bag. Uh-oh. No. Different view, guys. Um, yeah, my phone did that overheating thing, and I thought I lost everything. So that's why I said no. <laughs> that was funny. So anyway, I did not lose everything. Thank goodness. So yeah. So I got you on a different angle just because I'm under a shade tree for goodness sake. I don't know. I think I'm going to try to put it back up here. And hopefully, because I was almost done anyway. So yeah, I'm going to try that. But anyway, I hate when that happens. I don't know what causes that. But anyway, I was going to tell you guys, I found me a eyebrow, it looks like a mascara thing, down in my bottomless makeup bag pit that I have. And it's the same color as my hair. So it looks natural, right? Can you see that? It's, it's like natural. I love that stuff. It's from Revlon. I don't know if I got it at the Dollar Tree or where, but I love it. So anyway, I just want to tell you guys that. Now let's get on with this haul. This is something new that I found. It's from LA Colors. It says lips. It just says lips. And it says lip gloss and lip liner pencil. So I grabbed it. I'm like, that's really cool because, you know, the lip, the lip liner. And I don't know if that color is going to go good with my hair or not but I'm gonna leave it up here guys because you know um, I like to try out all lip products for you guys and that's because I'm a lip junkie I really am I've got so many millions millions <laughs> maybe not that many but look at that color I really like it and it looks like it has a nice sheen to it which is good so let me just see if it has a color on it topaz it says topaz, and it really does look like it's going to be, like, has have a frosty look. I love frosty looks. I absolutely love them. So, I'm going to put this up here. Somebody said my, my, my visor is like Narnia's closet or something like that. I can't remember, but it's so true. I've got so much junk up there. It's ridiculous. Okay, so I hope my screen is clean since I was fooling with my phone. Um, I, I, got, I grabbed some more of these just because I've been using them. Um, I don't know if my husband's been using his or not. It's on the sink. So if he doesn't, it's his loss. I'll use it. I don't even care. But wait a minute. I was thinking I got two of these. I guess I didn't. Uh, these, this is my favorite one. This is the one that I've been using every time. And it's the cucumber. It probably doesn't say that. I don't think. It just says go fresh. 48 hour. No, it says something else. Cool essentials. Yeah. But I love the smell of that. It smells wonderful. So grabbed one more of those. And then I got one more of these black and white ones. And I feel like I might have another one from a different haul somewhere. And then I grabbed one more of the men's. My husband didn't seem as excited as I was because this is a great deal. If you guys have ever bought the regular size of these, they are literally five or six dollars you know so these this is a really good deal this is the clean comfort so i grabbed three more of those while they still have them because i know they won't have them long 
that's a great deal okay now i did grab one more of these i did not have this one in my last my last haul and because i was i couldn't remember which ones i had so i got the lavender and vanilla lavender oil and vanilla i don't think i did did i i don't think i did not have this I don't think I did because I smell lavender and I don't remember saying anything about smelling lavender, but the color, would you look? So gorgeous. I mean, that's just so pretty. I love it. I love it. Okay, guys. So that is going to be this haul and I'll just sit here and do another haul since I have nothing else to do before I go back into work. No, maybe I won't. I don't know. I'll, I'll think about it. I'll have to decide. I don't know, but look what I'm carrying today. I'll be, uh, yeah, I got all my stuff in here for work. My wallet and my uh, my um, planner and stuff like that. I just thought I'd take carry it today since it's the last day before the fourth anyway. So, yeah. Anyway, um, we are, the last I looked, I was 20... I'm thinking 22 away from 6,000. So super, super excited. By the time you see this, I'm sure that we will be at 6,000. So I'm very excited. And so that means I'll be doing the crafting giveaway. I have to gather up all this stuff. I've got a bag I've been putting the stuff in, but I've got the stuff that Miss Ellen sent me and different things that I have been collecting that are probably still in bags. So I need to unpack like all my Dollar Tree bags so I can get all of that stuff together and get set each of the individual giveaway stacks up some will be different than others so anyway i just want to say be watching for that because i'm sure it is definitely coming up this weekend um yeah probably sunday because craven's going to do his fourth of july stimulus he's going to announce that on saturday so i'm sure sunday i will be announcing the 6,000 subscriber giveaway so i'm super excited so anyway i just want to say thank you guys for watching thank you for commenting all of your comments i love them i love reading them i love interacting with you guys and it's just a blast you guys are a blast and y'all say some of the funniest things and wonderful things as well so anyway guys I'm blabbering. Thank you guys. Give me a thumbs up. Bye guys.